5.1 simplifying a ratio of factored polynomials. So again, we work with the numbers. 9 goes into this. Let me see. Does 9 go into 54? Yes, it does. So 9 goes into 9 once. 9 goes into 54 six times. And you do have one factor here that matches a factor there, so those can reduce as well. However, these two factors are not the same. And you cannot, under any circumstance, cancel part of a factor. You have to... You can only cancel factors. So like 9 can be written as 9 times 1. 54 can be written as 9 times 6. And it is the factor 9 that I canceled there to get the 6 and the 1. You couldn't say that, um, like start breaking this up with a plus sign. Like 54 is 50 plus 4 and 9 is 10 minus 1. And then cancel, reduce the 50 and the 10. You cannot do things like that, okay? You can only cancel factors, not terms. Terms are added and subtracted, okay? So I did cancel these factors because this whole factor is being multiplied by something else and this whole factor is being multiplied by something else. So the entire factors can cancel. And what I'm left with is the six and y minus seven in the numerator and then one and y plus 2 in the denominator. Now you can clean this up a little bit. You don't necessarily have to distribute the 6, but because you're just multiplying by 1 at the bottom, you don't need the parentheses. And so this is what the final answer would look like.